And Chief, can you just tell us a little bit about what happened here today? So we received a uh, fire call early this morning. Ended up being a mattress fire. We believe the mattress was started um, by a table that had a candle on it and caught the mattress, a corner of the mattress on fire and the smoke went throughout the house. Uh, the mattress was located in the basement. The Mashpee Police Department arrived on the scene first and I believe they assisted the occupant in getting the mattress uh, outside and putting the uh, fire out. So it was the occupant and the police who put the fire out? I believe it was the, po the police and the occupant to put the fire out. Fire department arrived, the fire was pretty much already out. However, the whole house was charged with smoke and the one uh, male occupant had a uh, minor burn on his uh, left hand. On the way down here, I heard it was described as a second degree burn. Can you just tell us what that means? Because a lot of people don't really know what that means. So a second degree burn is pretty much indicated by blistering and uh, you know they'll want to check and see if there's a, a, a third degree burn is usually a deep tissue burn. So the second degree burn uh, you're going to kind of want to take a good look at. Um, he also had some soot around his nose, so it's a good chance he took in a lot of smoke. So for the better of the patient uh, to go get checked out at the hospital. How much longer do you expect to be here? Well, our biggest problem now is getting all the smoke out of there. So uh, the people that live there are going to have to sleep somewhere else and see what the insurance company does. Probably have to be cleaned and maybe deodorized. Um, mattresses put out a very tough, nasty smell. Yeah. So, yeah. So all in all, a pretty good save. It could have been worse. It could have been worse. Smoke detectors uh, went off throughout the building, so everybody was uh, notified. We like that. Uh, the smoke detectors are look like they're under 10 years old, so that's really important. Smoke detectors that are older than 10 years old, you should get them replaced. Very good. Thanks a lot, Chief. You're welcome. Thank you.